This is going to be an interesting one. Welcome aboard passengers, Mega Sim here. Welcome to Ruddington, the Nottingham Heritage Railway. We're going to be having a look at a few of the trains that are going to be here today. But one thing in particular, of course, is the HSD, the Class 43. The 125 group are based here and today and tomorrow, they've got two HSTs, cars, power cars, and a few cars in between, carriages in between. And we're gonna have a look at this. So yeah, shall we uh, go and have a look? We may not be able to get in the cab, I don't know. We'll see how it goes, but we will go in the carriages, but I'll go clip by clip and uh, see what happens. But there is a, there are a few people in the cab at the moment. So just bear with us. Well, I say bear with us, it will be instantly afterwards. Uh, but I'll have to queue. Anyway, look at that 47. Gorgeous. But yeah, I've seen a few trains here, so let's go and uh, have a look closer at the uh, HST. Here we go. So we're in a cab. Let's have a look at the controls and look at the differences that we've got. Look at that. Got the brake, the emergency brake. We've used that a few times, haven't we? <laughs> There's our lights. Always remember to do them. There, we go there, the horns there. Power. Heating, of course. Got a bit of a clock there. It's a bit there. Okay, sorry, mate. <laughs> Yeah, look at that. How amazing would that be going 125 in real life on here? That's cool. So yeah, what we'll do is, uh, if it's all right, we'll go in the back and uh, take a look at uh, what's behind us. You know, we don't get to go in the back virtually, so let's do it in real life. Yeah. Right then, so let's have a look in the well, back. It's so gonna be uh, play, quite we'll tight. Be but man, down. look at this. Yeah. So let's try and fit through. Man, it's tight in here. I think you're going in here at uh, 125 miles an hour. Wow, that'd be weird. Yeah, look at this. The engine noise in here. Wow, that would be very loud. Oh. So as we uh, go through. Look at this, everyone. <laughs> and look, it's quite light in here because of that. But look at this. This train was in bits when they got it. It was literally in bits from East Midlands Trains or East Midlands Railway. It was in the old EMT colours. And yeah, literally scrap, you know, parts were pulled from all sorts of places. So they're slowly rebuilding it. And look at this, look. This is us slowly getting through. Oh, the smell of it is amazing. It's so good. Such a good smell. And then look. Oh, look. <laughs> Hello out <up> there. <laughs> look at that. Can't get any further. Man, look at, look at it. Look. It's just so tight to get through. Man, the noise in this bit as well. You just can't imagine people actually walking through here. But yeah, just having these ear defenders on because it is loud. It is loud. Oh man, this is amazing though. Look at that. We'll have a look around. We'll take a few shots as well on, on the camera. So you can got some photos, but what we'll do is we'll look on the outside and uh, then we'll uh, go in the carriages. But yeah, wow. This is so good, love it. Oh man, that was amazing. Hopefully you've enjoyed that too. That was in the cab of this. 
So yeah, this was literally in bits when it came from East Lebanon's trains. And look at it now, it's slowly getting there. Slowly getting there. But yeah, gorgeous train. Hey look, we were in there. <laughs> In there look at this that's great so yeah let's have a look down the train look at this so yeah look 43 125 group um is on there yeah. yeah they said that there's no batteries in there so it is dead as a dodo on there but look at that so let me know in the comments What's the livery, you know, what livery should this be in? Look at the seats with the uh, weird swirly. It looks like rose. But yeah, what do you think? Where do you think this, uh, this was based? Whose line was this? Who had this carriage? All we're gonna do is we're gonna go in the train. We're gonna go in the carriage and then take it from there. So we go. No, no they were quite easy. So look, remember there's no handles here. You have to pull the window down to open the door. There we go. Look at this. Are you enjoying this as much as I am? Man, this is so good. This is so fun. sit down mm. oh yeah nice comfy seats it's not first class but it could be no it's not first class it's standard but oh wow and the toilet is the toilet available no nope it's not available it's locked but that's fine but yeah this is the buffet car this is in a gorgeous color Look at this, I'll show you this. Oh yeah, we're in the original blue colors. And look, the buffet car is open. And here it is. But yeah, can we actually walk through here? We can walk through here. Because remember this is always closed, so we can never go on it virtually. And here's the kitchen, the menu master, Ooh, kettles, that's good. It's where they cook the breakfast in the morning and wash the plates at the end. Or maybe a panini as well. <laughs> Look at that. That's so good. Right, let's go through to the next bit. So this is the other side. I haven't taken any photos in the kitchen, but that's fine. We got the video footage, that's pretty good. But yeah, can I? Cup of tea, please. <laughs> nice. Right, let's go and have a look, because they have a bit of merch here on the 125 group, so it's nice to have a look. It's tempting. I may come back. Because, yeah, we've got the uh, intercity stuff here. We've got the posters because I remember these these pictures that when they were taken and they were online so it's really nice to see these prints here and look at this look at this gorgeous seat these are lovely seats in first class aren't they they're so good and the uh, the lights as well hey yeah, we've got that already we've got that one do you want a couple of tubes for the other two? Um, yeah, yeah, that'd be great. Thank you. And the nice prints, yeah. That's that's a good print there. That's a really good one. So yeah, what we'll do is uh, we'll carry on to the next carriage. So just having a look outside of the buffet cart. Look at that. And it's got the power. Power's connected. That's the buffet car. But yeah, we're going to go in the green GWR one. Let's go through now. Follow the arrow, of course. Just fit through here. Just a little bit for the uh, the train manager. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll be shortly arriving at London Paddington. <laughs> 
So yeah, look, we've got the... Uh... Now I need to get this right. It's not purple, it's blue. <laughs> it just looks very purple. Yeah, look at that. So we're in the first Great Western carriage. Uh, it's green on the outside, but we've still got the original blue and the bit of the pink for the first um, in the in the seats, in the seating. But yeah, oh, it's gorgeous, this train is so good. I am gonna miss them because I don't have them on my line anymore. As you know, on the middle of main line, we don't have them, but let's go. Out we go. And then here is the, uh, the rear of the world record breaking train. So we had the front one. Hear that guys that's amazing what a perfect timing this is <laughs> that was not planned that was not planned at all. Ooh. Yeah, 43159, this is the one that was on the rear of the world record breaking train. We know that the other end was uh, the one that East Midlands Railway had and painted it in the uh, intercity colors. Good does that sound? Not been able to get into the cab on this one because I think uh, the 125 group are <laughs> enjoying it. Love to go into the back, but I don't think that's possible at this present moment. But man, how good is this? How good is that? An extra paster as well. No, no, no. <laughs> right, what we're going to do is we're going to have a look and see if there are other trains around here. I've seen some other low coasts, so we might have a closer look at them. But the main reason for being here today was for the HST, the class 43. And oh my goodness, the noise brings back so many good memories. And hopefully it brings back memories for you too. I know this is the newer engine, but how good is this? So yeah, we have the pacer here. I've come a little bit further away just because of the noise of the HST, but we have a pacer here. We've got our steam trains here. We've got a class 08, just in bits over there, but just wanted to have a look at the pacer this side. Look at that, an old Northern. I know people don't like pacers. I don't like pacers either. Look, just with the one wheel, when that goes around the corner, oh, it's awful, but I think they'll be missed in some way. It's just, uh, yeah, it's just one of those things where it's history. Even though it's bad history, it's still history. Look at this. Look at this. This is so good. Should go and have a look and see if we can get on the footplate. Oh, they've switched him off. <sighs> Switch the HST off now. Look at that LMS. There's the uh, EWS 08. But yeah, what we'll do is we'll have a look at some of the other places, uh, some of the other locos here as well. Oh, this day just gets better, doesn't it? Look at this. <laughs> the class 20. I wish they could start this one up. Oh, that would be amazing. Right, let's uh, back up a bit because I want to get the full, full effect of the train. So look at this. So good. It's been restored so well. Looks amazing. But yeah, as you can see, look, it's never good to go this way because look, you can't see a thing. So that's why when they put them in, they put them in reverse. So you got a better view. You know, these are not the class 08s where it's a little nose and it's all right. 
this is a very long nose, look at that. So you would put it in reverse so you can see straight out of there. Gorgeous, look at that. That's so good. All we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, have a look around and see if there's anything else to look at because unfortunately the sheds and stuff are closed so it's just what is out that we're able to have a close look at. And I think there might be some buses over there as well.
So look at these, that's a Felix bus to Tup Ilson. You've got your Barton buses to Cotman Air Farm and Nottingham and Ruddington. That's cool to see. You know, it was not that long ago that these buses were all over Derbyshire and now we've got the modern ones with Trent Barton and you know, even Felix, you know, Felix buses. It's been a while since I've seen a Felix bus. Look at that Barton bus, the engine, look at the doors, look at the doors on them, nice, parcels carried, first aid, look at that, Midland General, Barton Robin Hood, look, there's that 08 over there, there's class 40 there, Unfortunately, that bit's all closed, so we can't go to that bit there, but it's nice to see it. I wonder what this is like when the trains are running. That'd be cool, but no, the main reason for coming here today was the uh, HST. That was good to see. That was really good to see. Look at that. Well, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos from Le Mega Sim. Just sitting on board this HST one more time. Give it a thumbs up if you did like it. Let's me know that you care. Social media links are in the description below. And yeah, we will see you on the next video. It's nice to be on here, isn't it? It's nice to be on here. But yeah, this is Mega Sim. Out of here. See you later, guys. Bye. Sound face.